Hey there guys, this is Donna Bells. Welcome back for some more Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine! Baxter, you're getting in my way. He says hello. Say hello to everybody. Can you say woof? Say woof. Okay, well he growled at you. Mad dog! Anyway, <laughs> speaking of mad dogs, we're going off to Chain Chomp's bath. Uh-oh. Better not say bath around Baxter, he'll get even more mad. Speaking of mad dogs, this one is pissed. Probably because his owner sucks. Of course. I mean, the other dogs are mad too. I'm sure it's all the woman's fault. And she's just like, doesn't take responsibility. Okay, Mayor, what's going on here? You need to control that woman. Hey, you! You got another problem over here. This thing's bigger than all those pups put together. When it's chained up, there's no problem, of course, but when things loose, they're in heaps of trouble. Oh, yes. Mm hmm. <laughs> That'd be sooner. Always has burnt hands. It's pitiful. Yeah, well. Maybe you shouldn't allow her to have dogs. Just saying, you are the mayor. Hello, blue coin. Blue coins. Okay, let's talk to this woman. What the fuck is wrong with you? Seriously. I'm the one who should be steamed. Should head over to the hot springs to call myself. Yeah, well, you. Maybe control your doggies. What you do to make it calm is throw a big barrel of water on it and it's it's fine. But um, you gotta unchain it from the ground. And I'm just gonna let it run around because if you try to drag it all the way to the springs when it's cool from like the other side of town, then it's just gonna get mad before you know you can actually carry it all the way and then it'll like run away from you and it'll all be pointless. So what I usually do is grab this little barrel of water here. Looks like a Donkey Kong barrel. I think they did that on purpose? Woo. Well, I, I don't know. Barrels all kind of look the same anyway. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Anyway, what I do is I wait for him to come over. Meow. And he's going the wrong way. No. Okay, well, hopefully next time he goes the right path. So he'll go to the left. To the left, to the left. Go, puppy. Yeah, there he goes. And then he'll go around the town and um, follow the left side of the path. And, uh, when he comes over here, I'm just gonna... Ew, look at Mario. Break it down, Mario. That's his barrel dance, I guess. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> they seem to be avoiding you. Who's they? Everybody? Well, they should be thanking me, because I'm the one controlling all the dogs, and cleaning up their mess, and blah, blah, blah. Okay, so here he comes. Here he comes. I like to wait here and ambush him. You just throw it on him. Boom! Yay, I got him! Okay, come here, puppy. You just grab him with B and then pull him all the way to the spring. Come here, puppy. Come on. Let's take a bath. Yeah. Get in the bath, puppy. <gasps> good boy. Yeah. Get a good puppy. No, now he's all calm and happy. I think if you talk to the Piantas around town, they'll say that the spring has like magical powers and that it makes you calm or whatever. So that's why the doggies all like relaxed now. Ah. My dogs don't get relaxed when they're in the tub. They just freak out the whole time unless I offer them treats and like feed it to them while they're actually bathing. <laughs> Poor things. I need to give them a bath soon actually. Okay, blue corns. I have a few that I can get right now because gotta keep getting those blue coins. I actually, I know I missed a couple. <laughs> In the last um, level here, I'll have to go back at some point. I'm sorry, I didn't even notice until I was like actually editing, but you guys got me. I know, I'm gonna have to go back. It's okay, I'm 100%ing this game, so just in the future, if I miss something, you know, it's cool to point it out, but I, I, you know, just know that I'll notice it at some point because I am 100%ing the game. I'll be like, wait, what happened? You know what I mean? So, nah, well, what can you do? Okay, so. Ooh, I know where there's one. It's over here in the dried up pond, or the pond, the stream rather. Ta -da! And then there's, I think, a couple on the other side too. I think we have to go up the tree. I'm pretty sure there's one up there. If there's not, then that would be just silly. Hello, Mayor. Hello. <laughs> I hate going up these things. I feel like I'm gonna fall every single time. Like I almost fell when I got to the top of the uh, the other tree racing Il Piantissimo. But uh, it's okay, I didn't fall. It's all good. As long as you don't fall, you almost fall, it's okay. But if you don't fall, it's cool. I'm for sure gonna fall when we have to, oh God, I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall right now. Ah! That was a close one. Oh man. But when we have to uh, catch onto the little like 
the fluffy things. Like the dandelion fluffy seeds. I always fall in that low. It's terrible. It's terrible. Yes! Ow. Sorry, Mario. All right, there's one more corn over here. Ta-da! It's hiding in the grass. And there's some blue butterflies over here, but I think I can get those with Yoshi at night. Which, we're gonna go get Yoshi next level. Yay! I love my little Yoshi. Yoshi poo. All right, thank you for the shine, puppy. Good doggy. Yeah! <laughs> All right, so I think that the next level is the uh, the secret of the uh, the underside of the village, or I don't know what it's called. Okay, yeah, we're not gonna go there yet. Let's see though, because I know everybody says that it's like one of the hardest levels ever, but I don't know. I I mean it's difficult, but I wouldn't say it's like one of the hardest things in this game. It is secret of the village underside. <laughs> awesome. I like this level. I don't think it's really that bad. But we'll see. I'm sure I'll die like five times. <laughs> well, well. And we get little Yoshi. Yay! Let's go see what he wants. What does my little Yoshi want? Okay, Duffies, get away from me. Okay, he wants a pear. Get away! Yeah! I'm gonna stick my Yoshi on you later. You'll see. Mm -hmm. Yoshi can actually eat wind Duffies. That's badass. Yoshi can eat anything. <laughs> All right, let's head to the uh, Yoshi tree of plenty here that magically grows every single fruit ever. <laughs> it's magical. I, I think you wanted a pear, right? That looks yellow. I even said that. What he wanted, yeah, it's a pear. Okay, cool. Oh, excuse you, Mario. Jumping the wrong way. So I'm gonna get um, a few blue corns before that we can only get with Yoshi. One of them has to do with these bees. I'm pretty sure I've gotten um, blue coins with bees before with Yoshi, but... Ah! I always get stung! Okay, I think the trick to this is um, always moving. Damn it. Then see, I'm moving and I still get stung. Is always trying to move and try not to stay in the same spot while licking. Because Mario gets stung and it's just... It's just bad news. Bad news bears. Okay. Come on. No! Please do not fling me off the side of this island. Please. Ah! Okay, two more. Two more. Die, bitches. Oh, yeah. Okay, there's one more. Um, there's one more. What is this? Honeycomb? I guess. I don't, uh, bee? Bee cave? Bee, uh... What, what is it? Honeycomb? No. I don't freaking know. Bee... Bee home. Bee, beehive. Beehive. Why the hell couldn't I think of that word? What an idiot. <laughs> anyway. Lord we have over here. Hup, hup. Oh yeah, she sounds so cute. Love him. And I remember, um, who is it? Tennis Bubba. He said, makes me want this makes me want to have a pet named Yoshi. I totally had a pet named Yoshi. It was a cat. But I only had him for about six months. Um, and I named him Yoshi because he had like the brightest green eyes ever. So pretty. But he ran away. Meh. Honestly, um, he ran away near, um, like in my hometown, near a friend's house. So whenever I go see that, oh my gosh, don't fling me off. Whenever I go see that friend, I always see Yoshi roaming around. But he's a wild cat. I picked him up off the street when he was a baby, so. I guess Yay, blue corn! I guess whenever you pick up a stray cat, it's always gonna have like the stray cat instincts. Plus I didn't get him fixed, so that's probably why he ran away. Ugh. Just saying. Remember, get your pets spayed and neutered, boys and girls. <laughs> oh Bob Barker over here. Ah! Okay, yeah, she needs some juice. Yeah, so these are the butterflies I was talking about. Um they always spin. You can't get them unless you like hop. Or at least I usually can't get them unless I hop up and down. So stop moving in a circle, butterflies. My goodness. All right. A few more. And we get another blue corn. Ah! Yay, I got it. Um, okay, okay. One more blue coin I'm going to get in this episode. 
<laughs> this reminds me. If y'all haven't seen this uh, fan-made video that, um, I don't remember the name, but I will post it in the description. <laughs> it's the funniest thing ever. Uh, if you ever seen Pocahontas in the Colors of the Wind song, she goes, Have you ever heard the wolf cry to the blue corn moon? <laughs> he, like, adds a moon, or a blue coin instead of the moon. Best thing ever. The corn moon! Yes! <laughs> Literally. Best video ever. You seriously, you have to see it. It's hilarious. Donna Bell's approved. <laughs> okay, it's time to get down to real business here. Dubbies, I'm gonna eat you. I'm gonna eat you. No! See, told you. Don't mess with my Yoshi. That's all I'm saying. Okay, so we gotta head down here. There's plenty of coins. Actually, I don't know. This might be a good, um, a good level to get all 100 coins in. I don't even know which level I should get 100 coins in. Ah, I'll have to look it up. Or practice or something. Because I already have, like, 40 coins here. Crazy! Well, it's good to get at least 50 because a lot of people do say that this is one of their, like, most difficult levels that they have trouble with or whatever. So, if you get 50, you should be able to lick that one up, that one up off the tree. I don't know why they do that. But, yeah. It's good to get as many one-ups as you can before doing this. <laughs> Just say. Yeah! Okay, there's the secret. See, there's that fatty stuff. Let's melt it off with Yoshi's juice. Yayo! One-ups! Yay! Hopefully I won't have to use many of you, but here we go! Oh no! No flood! Or Yoshi. Nay. Here we go, guys. <laughs> it's the Chucksters. Yeah. I think the trick to this is just... I don't know. You just have to really look at what angle you're talking to these guys at. It's kind of like pool, you know? You gotta, like, concentrate for a second. So this guy you want to talk to straight on, like, head on. Ah, the chucks, they're there. Okay, see? I did good. As long as if you get the coins there, then you know you're doing good. And this little guy right here, I usually like to talk to him and get it kind of an angle. Like, just a small angle. Uh, okay. Uh, no, no, no. No! Okay, if you talk to him way back here, then you're not gonna be able to make that next platform. So just get a little bit to his right, and that'll make, like, talking to him, like, no, no, no! <laughs> that was my fault. Damn it. Damn it, that was my fault. It's not even because I chose the wrong person or talked to him at the wrong, wrong angle. Blah, blah. I can't even talk. Okay, remember this guy, straight on. <laughs> okay, that's good. Ooh. Yay, that was good. Okay, and then talk to him at a little bit of an angle. But yeah, right here's good, I think. Maybe a little, but I never give up. Yes, success. And this guy you have to talk. I don't know, I can't talk right now. You have to talk to straight on. <laughs> higher, higher. Yeah. Okay, I'm doing pretty good. And this guy you talk to straight on. Just make sure you're right in front of his nose, and that's it. Ah, the jokester! Okay! Yay! Okay, this one... This is, like, the critical one. You have to talk to straight on, facing left, and he's gonna stop right here. So... Uh, oh, no! No! I didn't get him in time! <gasps> no! <laughs> that was my fault. Uh, shut up. I know, too bad. Meh. Okay. Well, at least I died like on the last one. So I was almost there. This will be the last time, I swear. I swear, you guys. It's gonna be awesome. Okay. <laughs> yes, yes. That was good. That was good. Okay. Now get to a little to his right. His right. Well, I guess now it's his left when he's not facing you. To your left. Little to your left. Okay. Yes! Good job, good job. Okay, get straight in front of his nose. Nope, nope, that's not good. Quit pushing me, man! Dang! Rude! Oh, okay. Yay! I think if you get the coin in the air, then you're pretty much set. Alright, straight in front of his nose and you're good. Whee! <laughs> I love how Mario always sounds like he's having fun, even when he's being, like, chunked in the air and he might die at any second. 
No big deal. He's still having fun. <laughs> he knows that he has, like, lives, and even when it's game over, he just comes right back, so... No worries for Mario. Okay, dude, I'm not talking to you right there. You better stop right in front of me, or I'm gonna kick your ass. Seriously. Come here. Come talk to me. Now stop. He usually stops right here. Stop. No! What? 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 You, what? You're supposed to stop, sir. Rude. Ugh. Gosh. Okay, so I might as well show you. Um, there's the shine, and all you have to do is get straight in there, and there's like bumpers on the edge, so as long as you get somewhere in there, you're good. And on the other side, I think there's like just coins. Yeah, there's a coins and a one-up. I don't think it's even worth going over there, to be honest. Okay, sir, you better, okay, even if he doesn't stop this time, which, I don't know, he might not, um, I'm just gonna try to talk to him straight on, like, get right here, and try to get as straight as possible, oh my gosh, get straight, get straight, okay, okay, that's good, and, B, I'm a trickster, ah! I did it, yes, haha, <laughs> see, now, you can't just, you can't overthink it too much, but, you know, I guess practice is what it is, just like with pool. Gotta get the right angles in there. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. I will see you again tomorrow. Love you, bye.